people don't understand about my oldest daughter. My oldest daughter kept me in check, really kept me, kept me in line and kept me in check from doing a lot of dumb shit. Like my brothers, if anybody know anything about my brothers, man, especially my brother KB, at one point he was a wild ass dude. And I was smart, but I would follow this nigga to the ends of the earth. And it was a lot of situations that for me having a kid is like, yo, I'm not going, bro, I'm not going to go with you this time. That got him jammed the fuck up. And I've been right behind, and I would have been right behind him. It was, like I said, the, I always talk about the situation. The only time I all the, ever thought about killing somebody. The first time. If it wasn't, my daughter put hesitation in me. Just enough to make the right decision. You know what I mean? Just a, just a split second of me thinking about her put the right decision in me probably being in jail for 20 years. Because if it wasn't for her being there, I would have reacted completely different. I wouldn't have had that thought process of, I wouldn't have had that thought process because what came in my mind was, is she going to hate me? How old is she going to be? Who's going to raise her? Who's going to take her, take care of her? And it was just that little pause that put that little pause in me to make me say, yo, wait and see how this situation plays out, Kev, before you pull this trigger. And it would it was just enough, just that little pause. And the situation went right for me. God made the situation right for me because I had that little pause. If I didn't have her and I didn't have that pause, shit would have went left for me. I wouldn't be, I probably wouldn't be sitting here doing this podcast or these kids or having the situation, life, lifestyle I have right now. Real rap.